17 wins, zero losses, and two ties. It was a dominant regular season for the Bemidji State soccer team, and now it's tourney time for the Beavers. With their NSIC regular season championship, BSU earned the one seed in the conference tournament, hosting the eight seed Northern State at Chet Anderson Stadium. It was a cold and windy one today, but even a bit windier when you're playing right on the banks there at Lake Bemidji. Nine minutes in, Allie Smith with a beautiful pass up ahead to Mason Schilling. She's going to get tripped up in the box. That'll result in a whistle and penalty kick for the Beavs. Aaron Becker steps up to the box, cool, calm, collected, and buries it just inside the right post. Beavs up 1-0. After halftime, Schilling back out on the pitch, looking for Smith on the cross. Nearly a goal, but Alexis Townsend there for the stop for the Wolves. 71st minute now, Maggie Cade gets out in front of the defense and once again, Northern is gonna commit a penalty inside the box, can't do that. So the Beavs send Becker back to the box and if the keeper wasn't already frozen, she is now. Becker this time goes left, her second PK goal of the afternoon. Bemidji State gets a 2-0 quarterfinal win and no doubt about it, the difference in this one, Becker's ability to come up big in the box. She's extremely good at uh, the placement, but also the pace of the ball with the placement. And then she has the ability to go to both sides. So um, one penalty kick went to her right, one went to her left. So it's a, it's a tough situation for a goalkeeper to be in when she steps up and uh, just feel pretty blessed to have her in those situations. I guess PKs are more mental than anything. You gotta be just turn on and confident in whatever you do. So you gotta make a decision which way you're gonna go before you kick it obviously and just put it away. BSU now moves on to the NSIC semifinals. They'll get Concordia St. Paul at two in the afternoon on Friday at the Chet. The Golden Bears knocked off Minot State on the road tonight one to nil. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.